morning everybody and happy Mother's Day to all those beautiful, wonderful mothers out there. It's my way to my mom's house to go see her for Mother's Day and to see my kids. Slenderman or Jason comes out and we'll even though proof. they probably won't, we have proof. Can you win the bridge? There's a dragonfly Original on my, um, bur pants. Bridge collapse. Hey, you guys. Don't worry, Mom. <laughs> Yana, go back. The Yana, next creek back. has a waterfall. Where'd Mama go? Where's? Where's the baby? Where's the baby? Oh, Look at the baby! Where'd the mom go? She went over way. there somewhere. Aww. We'll She'll cry and it'll come to her. Or it will cry and she will come to it is what I meant to say. Alright, so we're leaving mom's. That was a very quick little visit. We went exploring and I found some nice pieces of wood that I could use in the garden. I got a nice little haul of fresh organic produce from my mom and I'm gonna do a little a little haul of all the nice produce I got from mom when I got home and then Eric and I are gonna work in the garden which I'm really excited about. So I'm home and Bella and I well Bella's doing dishes. I'm helping a little bit. No, she's not. I gotta she's just make videoing tea. and pooping on the toilet. <laughs> Between me and you, she took a big. Hi guys, it's me and Christy. And today we are gonna be treating the garden. First we're gonna look at these cute tomatoes. They're green though. So here they are. Pretty big. We have about a lot over here. You can see this one right here. See, they can go in the plant and you can see some other one. So right here, you can see how big this cucumber got to make pickles. Over there is Christy. She don't talk much. When we're done with the food we don't want. We recycle it and put it into a pile, put dirt over it, so that's what that is. Here is the mother of five kittens. And here is the mother of five kittens too. This is Sunny. And this one's name? Leo, I forgot. Oh, my mom sent me home with a bunch of goodies. Got little fingerling potatoes in here. Some snap peas, I think that's what they are. String beans, I don't know. Broccoli, and I guess it's just broccoli in there. Cabbage, my mom said. It looks like lettuce to me, but she said it's a cabbage. And we got some carrots, a beet, and some zucchini, an onion, an interesting looking squash, turnips. Uh, two things of regular cabbage, some more turnips, green onions, and some purple potatoes. They don't look purple right now, but they are. Squash growing. Something ate all of the cucumbers off of that plant that I planted by the fence. Garlic is looking nice. I need to get my marigolds in the ground. New blooms on the green bell pepper. And then I topped the red bell pepper because I wanted to get bushier so I cut this piece off and it's got some new uh, leaf growth in there. I really want to take a nap but there's a lot of things I need to do. I need to do laundry, we need to go grocery shopping, we need to clean the house and we've got to go get Gage. <laughs> this little kitten stalking its mom. Oh boy. <laughs> yeah, it's going to be enough for both of them. There we go. There's one down. Now for this one. Look how big our potatoes are. We're gonna start earthing them up now. We just went to the store and got some more compost, and topsoil, and garden soil. We're gonna mix it up. Some good looking stuff right there. So we got our fencing up. It's not keeping the cats out as you can see. Here's a pretty flower Eric grew from seed. Here's the peppers. It's like that's a little pepper forming there, but I could be wrong. Yeah, that looks like a little pepper to me. A couple of the cucumbers growing in here. This is the top of the pepper plant, the piece that I topped, and it started flowering. I've got it sitting in water. I, it was just an experiment. I didn't know if this would work. I don't see any roots or anything, but it flowered, and now it looks like 
it might be producing a pepper. I was just about to say that this cucumber plant isn't producing anything, and then I saw that. So there's at least one. So we just earthed up the potatoes. Eric and I disagree about the correct way of doing this, but we'll let him try it his way first. If it works this way, then I know that that's fine, and if it doesn't, then we'll try something else next time. We've got more seed potatoes starting up in the house. I've got some reds, some golds, and some purple. I'd got him a little strawberry kit, bag of blooms. We'll see. Let's see if it actually works. Alright guys, it's back to work for me. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you next time. Bye!